Hughes directed the film, which was released in 1930, and it cost $3.95 million to make, or about the equivalent of around $70 million today. The production of Hells Angels was fraught from the start. Three pilots died while filming, large portions of the picture had to be reshot when cinema switched from silent to talkies, and the project took three years to finish. Hells Angels was shot in black and white, save for one eight-minute, two-strip multicolor segment, which is the sole surviving color footage of the film's lead, Gene Harlow. According to Wired, Hughes was a film obsessive who would lock himself off from the world for months on end in his own screening room, naked while eating candy bars and sipping milk. Follow the link below to watch the full video on this eccentric billionaire, his exciting life, and tragic end.